Hello and welcome to you all from the Giuseppe Miazza in Milan. And here we have Argentina against Peru. I'm Peter Drury and seated in the experts hot seat is our man Jim Beglin. Thanks Peter, it's a pleasure and a privilege for me to be here. Now the cross. Now it's Higuain. Di Maria. It's Di Maria! Gets good distance on it. Oh, well intercepted. Really alert to the danger. Looks like a good ball through. Great ball and now the shot. De Michelis tries a long pass towards the front. Now it's Messi. Messi. That is a terrific run. Some excellent tackling here, and that one a perfect example. Good challenge, he just stood firm. And it's Messi. Chance to shoot. Who's ball? Who's going to get there? Now it's Pizarro. Oh, they could break here. Looks to slip it through. Messi. Villa. Argentina are seeing more of the ball, but still aren't carrying much goal threat. Ambitious to say the least, he seemed to be in a hurry to get that in. And it's Pizarro. Pizarro with the ball through. Tries a through ball. Little accusatory stare there tells the whole story. Yeah, I think the problem there was that the pass was, was telegraphed. An easy read for the defence. Tries to get it forward quickly. Mascherano. Bilia. Di Maria. Now the pass. Higuain. He's onside. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? The ball's loose. And he's after it. He's dealt with that well. Cuts it out. Ball's gone out of play. Decent effort as the first half draws to a close. So we reach the halfway point. Argentina ended that first half in such a strong fashion. I think we'll just have to wait and see now if they can rekindle that drive and that determination. It's been great commitment and that has to be maintained in the second half. An engrossing half, but we're still where we started. Nil-nil. Well, this guy is just not your average footballer. Alert and sharp. And while one or two others were still digesting the manager's half-time team talk, he's already delivering another lead. What a good player. That is simply brilliant. I dare anyone to top that. That's an incredibly difficult skill too, you know, but he'll also be grateful for that early delivery. Argentina take the lead. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. Gets it upfield. Aimed long and direct. Di Maria pumps it forwards. Not much subtlety, he's launched himself there. 
He's made sure that that won't get through. Mascherano pumps it upfield. That was one quality pass away from being a very decent chance. Looked very promising. Well, the idea was crafty, but the weight of the pass was just a little light. Danger averted for now. And that's another throw. And it's Bilia. Now it's Mascherano. And he's there to hoof it away. I have to say, that was an exemplary tackle. Stopped him dead in his tracks. No, no way through there. To Michalis. Well, it's a safety in numbers approach to defending here. Yeah, but dropping deep can bring more trouble, yeah? Well, shots from distance and, and space in wider positions, besides the obvious issue of inviting most of your opposition high up the pitch. Spoon forward. Someone looks like he's in need of protection here. Yeah, and having notched a goal already, Peter, he's not going to be allowed to run off the shoulder as, as much as he'll want. Bilia. Passes it through. Ball through needs to be good here. Pizarro. Keeper's got good distance on that. Pizarro was alert to the possibilities, but in the end it's fruitless. Done very well to intervene. And it's Higuain. Looks like a good ball through. Two minutes to be added on. Argentina just have to run down the clock. And there goes the final whistle. Argentina, hold on. It's a narrow squeak, bit of luck, some judgment. 1-0 the score at the final whistle. Yep, they got the win despite...